Yeah, it takes a lot of courage to step up again. And not only did you do that, you put it in exactly the same spot. Yeah, I mean, I tried to, to wait, you know, to, to look at the keeper. And, uh, yeah, I saw that he's going to go again for this side. So, obviously, the second one was a bit easier. Right, you, you, you didn't think about picking up the penalty yourself, did you? No, the second, the, the second time, definitely. But, again, I see Kai shoot penalties a lot of times in trading. And, bro, I was so confident. Even though he missed the first one, he knew exactly what he was doing. And he was confident again. And we knew, knew he was going to put it in the back of the net. Your goal in the first half was absolutely vital. It kind of brushed all the cobwebs away. Yeah, um, a little miss kick in first touch but then it landed perfectly and then you know that set us on our way to to build on that performance uh, that's another point are you going to build on this now because that's two two wins and this one was was aggressive and on the front foot yeah of course we have to you know uh, i think the last few weeks were hard for us you know we lost a lot of games so uh, today was important for us because we know uh, the champions league is uh, yeah an important um, tournament so it's our last tournament we're in at the moment so we have to to give everything for that and today we showed uh, character, we showed that we, we want uh, to win this competition again and that's the most important and now we have to build on this and also win games in the Premier League. Congratulations, man. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well played. Yeah, well played, those men. Oh, let's just talk about Kai Havertz taking that penalty for the second time. I mean, that takes some bravery, right? Yeah, no, to be fair, he stepped up. He showed real courage. Uh, and composure to step up, put it in the same place. I thought he was brilliant today. You know, he gets, a lot of people say, as a false nine, or playing in different positions. I just thought he was, he delivers. I thought he was absolutely fantastic today. Showed real composure in big moments. They need somebody to step up. Raheem did it in the first half. Kai Havertz in the second. I, I, imagine before leading to this game, the last few months, these players, not only the manager, the manager's been under a lot of pressure, the players as well being criticised. A lot of these players have been used to success, been used to being called greats and, and good players consistently well. But they've had a period of time where it's been, the fingers being pointed at them, what are you going to do? And this is a moment today where they can look at it and you can sense it with the players, the smiles on their faces, what this kind of means to this club and what this means to the individuals as well. And they've got to take this on now. This feeling here, suck this up, take this in the change room and let it continue. Yeah, enjoy it. Enjoy it. It's a huge pressure to play for any top club, and particularly Chelsea over the years, because you've known under the last regime, you, you, you lose two or three, four games, the manager could be out the door, the new manager might not like you, so you're always, you're never, you're never comfortable. No one at this club's ever been comfortable, no players. So you take that couple with all of the change, all of the noise around it, and you get a performance like tonight. I thought there was a little sparks of it on Saturday, little bits of patterns of play were starting to work. Kai Havertz coming into the game. Owen's right, he was out, absolutely outstanding tonight. Forget about, the, you know, the, the, what, what it took to take the penalty again and do that. But it's, it's a big, big moment in the season, Jake. A huge moment for Chelsea. And I can see that, you know, you won't want to be playing Chelsea in the next couple of weeks. And you're right when you say it's a big moment. I sometimes get that fear that we slip into sort of talking in cliches or saying things that aren't necessarily true. And you could say that before this game, this is a season-defining match. But actually, beforehand, you would question it maybe. Afterwards, you think it really feels like it, doesn't it? It really feels significant, Owen. Yeah, I mean, football's a roller coaster. Sorry, sorry. Too sorry, sorry. You OK? Let's see you. OK? Let's see you. Uh, football's a roller coaster. These guys have been on the roller coaster, by the way. Ten games unbeaten, and then they come here and they get knocked out. I think for, for Chelsea, you've got to enjoy the good moments because you, you get some bad ones as well. You know, you look at United, had, had a brilliant season so far, and all of a sudden you lose 7-0. Why, why is are we bringing that up right now? <laughs> it's a Libby. No, but, what, time. <laughs> but you need to enjoy the good moments. This is a huge moment for Chelsea. They have a di they've had a difficult season. This could turn everything around for them. Absolutely. They are in the hat for the quarterfinals of this season's Champion League, and that is big, very big indeed for them. Uh, right, just to let you know, we're going to take a quick break. Uh, after us, the 